Hello guys, what is up? Today we're going to be taking on Dr. Terror with all warriors. So the update just came out yesterday, which is pretty much the most awesome thing ever. I was on Boom Beach practically all day yesterday, which was awesome. Um, the, the, they made a new dock. It looks pretty sick. Instead of the ugly little moldy wood dock, I think it looks a lot more professional of a dock. And it kind of fits in with the whole feel of steel and metal and not this wood because like that was the only thing that was wood in the entire base. Um, I guess you could look at the landscape around it, but, um, anyway guys, I got my weapon lab upgrading to level 2, so that's pretty much the most awesome thing ever, and it looks like these people are carrying resources around, that's something I never noticed before, that's pretty awesome, so now we're gonna boost up some of our statues, I don't need resource rewards because I have a lot of resources, so let's go and boost these health, damage, and gumbo energy up, so guys, level 5 weapon lab costs... 4.9 million of each resource. That's terrible. That's like, oh, I cleared my map yesterday and I had 4 million of each resource. So 4.9, you're going to need to hold your resources overnight, which is going to be hard, um, and then get up the next day and farm more. So the new critters came out. I'm going to be placing some of those guys down, but they look pretty sick when they jump out. It kind of reminds me of Wally. If you get it's a Disney movie, I think it's Disney. Um, Anyway, guys, we're just going to be taking this base on with these little critters. I don't have a lot of critters coming out just because my critters are still level 1. I'm going to try to get my critters upgraded, though. So once my critters are upgraded, it's going to definitely be pretty much the most awesome thing ever because I think critters is such a good idea. So yes, Dr. Terror Stage 1 goes down. Um, only six more to go. So there's only seven stages. It's a lot more sp It's a lot more spread out and there's gonna be a new event each day guys. So expect more videos very soon um, So yes, let's go hit and a hit attack. There are no trees on this base basically only like two trees Okay, so first we're gonna have to take out these boom cannons here take out the boom mine so my troops don't die. And you know what? Let's just take this out with artillery and barrages. It's probably the most easiest thing you could do boom didn't need any critters. Critters are pretty awesome, guys, but I wish when, like, you view in your log, I wish it'd tell you if the guy used critters and how many critters died. That would just be pretty, that'd be awesome, guys. So, yes, I did rename my character to Fusion, my base to Fusion, because Pogified just kind of seemed like a noobish name. And so, I just, I love the word Fusion, guys. Infusion and Fusion are some of my favorite words, if not my favorite words. So, I definitely enjoyed renaming that. A lot of people on our task force renamed their names. Um, I think there's only, like, one two people who did it. I don't think Jimmy renamed his name, and I don't think he will. I don't know. I haven't talked to him since the update came out, and let's just cheat here, because I can't, I didn't get, uh, I didn't defeat all these, uh, bases. So, let's go and hit attack. I, I mean, I didn't defeat all the buildings. I need to be able to take down these buildings. I'll be a little more careful on my barrages and stuff. So, yeah, so Dr. Terror stages get a lot harder as you go on. Um, so, level... Five Dr. Tear stage would be like level 15 or 7 divided by I don't know I don't very which would be 15 yes so uh, Dr. Tear stage 5 would be 15 um you just times them together divide 7 by 20 and then times that number by your I guess you could just divide 20 by 5 no that wouldn't work I don't know I I am not thinking that in depth during a video um, okay, yeah, so I'm flailing to this flamethrower, excuse me, and once we're here, we're just gonna flail to this HQ, the big HQ, I kind of wish they'd do a uh, redesign on the HQs, a lot of smoke, but I, you, you can never be too skim on smoke, well, you can, but, um, the way I have enough energy, I don't, I don't think I need to, so I just realized that cannon was still there, so let's take it out, smoke is about to wear off, I could place critters, but I'm just going to do some shocks here and some med kits. Boom. Boom. Blows up, guys. Blows up. So, this stack to tear stage goes down. Tear stage 3, only 4 more left. Yes, only 4 more left. Awesome victory screen. They should, uh... Yeah, there's a lot of stuff they could do, but it's, it's just awesome. Okay, I'm just so excited for this update, guys. It's just, this update is a ton of fun. I got an intel, which is good. So now let's go on to Terra Stage 4. Um, Terra Stage 4 is starting to get harder. I'm going to have to use some smoke on the stage. Um, let's place my troops down on this beach for a second. And flare to this sniper tower. I try to go, I try to flare close to the beach. 
That way my troops could get there safely without losing too many numbers. And if you flare like halfway in the base, guys, with your first flare, your troops are gonna get there a lot slower. I mean, they're gonna they're gonna be more spread out. So you want to get them in line as soon as you land, and then you could flare them to your big building at the end. Um, that's pro tips of Christian 101. Okay, so we're on this HQ, and I just shocked my own troops. Oh my gosh. Okay, the base still goes out, and I did lose one, so that's bad. Um, I can't believe I shocked my... I shocked half my troops. I meant to place a med kit, guys. I meant to place a med kit. Okay, so yes, I got a shard, which is awesome. This stage goes down. Only three more to go. Two more? I don't know. Yes, so that was Tantus 4, so three more to go. Okay, so I only lost one, so let's go... Let's go train him back up. Terror stage 5. So, these are a lot of boom mines here, so let's place a barrage here. I could have placed, I probably could have placed a critter, but I, I don't know. It's barrages, I'm just a lot more, I know a lot more about the barrages and their formation. So I actually got shocked on the beach here, which isn't a big deal since these are not very high level shocks. So, after here, let's uh, flare to the HQ here and get my smoke out. We're going to go smoke 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 and we're on the HQ so I don't think I do I know I'm, I'm not I'm not needing I cannot talk I don't need a med kit for this guys I don't need a med kit for this so the smoke is about to wear off here smoke wears off I'm shocking everything let's place a couple med kits now and let's place oh that was not okay there we go and that's, I can't place anymore. I was going to place a critter, but then I realized I didn't have enough energy. Okay, so Terror Shed 5 goes down. Only two more stages to go. Terror, Dr. Terry, you're going down. Guys, this is probably going to be the only time in history where we're going to have three Dr. Terry days in a row. Like, I was hoping the new event would be today. Like, you know, but it isn't. So, we have two Dr. Terry days in a row. So, tomorrow is going to be the new event. So yes, guys, this is my armory. I have all, I have my warriors, my zookas, my heavies, my medics, all maxed, and most of my abilities. All I have left of my abilities is the critter. And I'm going to start upgrading the critter after my tanks are upgraded. I like upgrading one thing at once, and then after that thing's done, I upgrade a whole nother thing. Because that just seems like a, it takes a while to max out one thing, but once it is, it looks cool. Like, max level, you can't go anymore. You have this thing maxed in the game. So that's just awesome. I debated between my medics and my scorchers, but my medics are, uh, my, I could use my medics for any strategy. My scorchers, I can only use for one strategy. So once my tanks are done, I'm going to definitely upgrade these critters to level two. And I'm going to get my critters maxed because critters maxed, I, like you could have like 10 coming out of the boat. Um, there's seven levels of critters. So I don't know, do the math yourself. 13, I guess, 14. Something wrong with that. So now let's go and jump into Terror Stage 6. Okay, so we are moving on to Terror Stage 6 right here, guys. We're going to place a flare on these boxes, and we're going to go to these boxes. Like I said before, guys, you want to get your guys in line when you land, so you don't have to do it later, and they're not going to go off formation, because if they go off formation, guys, you're going to have to lose a lot more smoke, or you're going to lose a lot of troops. So now we're going to place some med kits, and my troops are stepping out of their box here. Why don't you just stay in your box, guys? I don't know. Okay, so my troops are moving in. I lost a few there. I lost a lot there, guys. And, uh, good. All those troops made their save, and they burned to death. Okay. I just lost, like, four warriors from burning to death. Here we go. Smoke is about to wear off. I have a med kit place, but my med kit was kind of offline. So we're going to do some shocks, and then we're going to place two critters, just because I haven't used critters yet in this video. So we're going to use a few critters. The good thing about critters is the closest thing to these buildings are going to blow them up. So critters, I, I found out that critters are very good on machine guns. And if the machine guns are not directly on the HQ, if the machine guns are directly on the HQ, but it's not going to be legit. Oh my gosh! I just got a fuse, fuse box, fuse, fuse, something, fuse, oh, I can't, I can't believe this, guys, I can't believe this, I cannot believe this, I didn't think you could get them from, from a Dr. Terror, I got a critical fuse, yes, so once my weapon lab is done, uh, upgrading, I'm gonna be able to use that, man, I am just so excited, 
Okay, guys, my troops are finally trained. It took forever to train them, 15 minutes. And now we're moving on to the last Dr. Terror stage. This is equivalent to level 20 Dr. Terror. Uh, it definitely doesn't look like a level 20 Dr. Terror. It definitely looks a lot easier. My my uh, resolution is kind of blurry. Okay, so we're going to be placing our troops on the beach. And like I said, you do a quick reflare just so you don't lose a lot of smoke. And we're going to place three smokes. And I, I wounded a lot of my troops, guys, but it should be fine. Let's take out these mines because they're probably level 20 mines. And those two mines are going to do uh, 500 damage to my warriors, which is terrible against this. So a lot of my warriors would die from that. So I did that. That's the reason why I did that. Okay, so I'm on the HQ. We're going to get our shocks out. I'm going to shock. I see a shock launcher over here. So let's shock the shock launcher. So if the shock launcher doesn't shock our troops. I just thought that was kind of cool to say all that at once. Like, it's just like shock, 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 shock. Okay, so it looks like we're going to get this. Hopefully we get this. Um, yep, we're going to get this. Yep, yep, yep. Okay, we got this. Good job. Um, this this stage goes down. Dr. Ted goes down. He'll come back in two days. So that's kind of nice. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. I got a complex gear. That's going to be it for this video. If you guys liked the video, be sure to leave a like. If you are new to the channel, be sure to subscribe. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Get some awesome Boom Beach wallpaper. Click the link below.